has come all the way from Port McGee in County Kerry. Sean O'Leary is with us. Sean, how are you? Good morning, good morning. Will you have a good morning? Oh, Shaq. I'm sketching me and me out of now and it. On the morning. You're really looking forward to this, Sean? Yes, it's going to be very, very interesting and very exciting, Dahi. Uh, speaking of interesting and exciting, you are both yourself. <laughs> Tell us all about yourself. Um, well, I'm Sean O'Leary. Yeah. I work down in Carsevine in the O'Connell Further Education and Training mm -hmm. Centre. And that's a great place to work, I must say. Not that just my colleagues uh, nominated me now yeah. or anything like that, and my manager, but it is just a great place. We do yeah. a lot of full-time, short-time courses, business and healthcare, but I look after the art and the horticulture. Yes, and you love it. I do. It's love great. It. I tell you, when you go back to work, it's like going home. Yeah. yeah. Is, is the great, is, is, is it a it great really thing is, to say? Yes. A great thing to say. Yes, altogether. You know, and uh, was that always the plan, Sean? Oh my God, there's been many plans. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there's been many plans yes. there along the way. But no, this is at what I'm most happy with now. Yeah. So you, and uh, how long have you been in this job? Uh, since COVID, mm -hmm. over COVID, just um, after COVID. Yeah, and, you're, 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 and this, this is it now, and you, you, you found your place. I found my place. I yeah. found my home for yeah, work. It's, it's, it's a great thing to say, Sean, isn't it? It is. Yeah. You know, you're kind of more... Um, so, but I suppose it comes with age as well. There's a yeah. certain age when you really want to settle down and yeah. you want to know what you're doing. Yeah. You know, I suppose most of my life I didn't have a clue what was coming up next, and that was great. That's great too. For yeah. Them, you at, know, the at, at the time, but you know, the old dog for the old road. The old dog. <laughs> the old dog as well. Sean, if we go back to last year, you, you had a tough time. You and your family. We did. We lost my sister Noreen mm -hmm. uh, to cancer in around the 21st of June. Yeah. And it was, it took a lot out of all of us, I think, uh, you know, there we are going to a wedding, the two yeah. of us. So there was 12 years between us. Yes. And we were like twins. Yeah. We were fantastic, you know. We ate the head off each other as well, of <laughs> course. Like, but <laughs> but sure, that's natural. That's it. Nobody else could do it better. Nobody else could do it. Like, yeah. yes, yes. And I'd imagine you, you, you miss her every day, Sean. Oh, you would. And it's funny because I still kind of chat to her and yeah. I'd nearly be giving out to her sometimes and I can see her chuckling now. Yeah. And I can definitely see her with me today you now, you know, oh. saying about... Bloody time they're starting that fellow. That's fellow, no, Christ. <laughs> and, and they have some job. <laughs> they have some yeah. job that has no trying to threaten that fellow. Yeah, yeah. Good stuff. I demand you, she would be laughing. Oh, the she whole would. Situation. She would, and she'd be delighted, and she'd be telling me all kinds of things to say to you. She would, of and course. To find out. Yes. And I met a lovely girl from Mayo out in the room now. Yeah. And when Noreen was alive, there was no way I could leave without having that girl's second name, where she was from. Yeah who her parents were, because Noreen knew everybody all over the world. Isn't it brilliant? Yeah, Isn't and she had that fantastic. interest in, in genealogy, I suppose, yeah. yeah. Sean, been been to Gintich Giel to Choma, you're, you're a storyteller. That's right, yeah. yeah. We're, we're bred for talking, as the man would say. <laughs> and uh, yes, I do love telling stories, yeah. and it's a great way of... Um, of keeping history alive and yeah. making sense of the world as well, Dahi. You know, yeah. if you can put a problem or a solution into a story, it seems to go much further yeah. and it hits the brain because you mightn't think of the solution, but you'll think of the story. Yes, of course. Mm. It must be totally alien to you to see people going around looking like this on their phones, they're scrolling up and they're scrolling down, they're not making any eye contact. It is, it can be very strange, but again, I must admit I can be like that too. Uh, that's okay. That's okay. That's but, okay, uh, yeah. But it is, it is, the world is changing. And it, I think somebody was saying recently, I heard them say that with every technological progression, yes. we're losing something yeah. as well, no matter how far forward yeah, we I know go, what you're we're losing a little bit as well. And it was great before when um, I'd be in the donkey car with Dad going yes. somewhere. <laughs> and should the work might never get done by the time we get there talking to this... Should the work was secondary? <laughs> yes, yeah, 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 to yeah, everything, yeah. you know. But there was a beauty to that too. Oh, there you was. When you, you look know. back, they go, that, that's what life was all about. All about, and everybody out, and everybody chatting. And then yeah. if there was any two gathered, the gullet yeah. is our place in Hambui. <clears throat> that was a meeting place for everybody. Oh, yeah. And the day after a gat or a match, There'd be four or five there on the Monday for, yeah, for the whole it's day. It's amazing. Yes. There's an old saying I heard years ago, Sean, years and years ago, and it goes like this in Irish. Nora mo nora 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 vonan gaur vaan children fad. When one goat pees, they all pee. Pee, yes, yeah. that's for sure. That's is that the way with your goats? Oh, it is. It could have easily happen now. Yeah. Or when one breaks out, they all break out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, there, there you have it. So, but yes. I heard that years ago. No, 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 no,
It's there's, amazing, there's isn't it? a physical it? kind of... And Camille, how, how long have you the goats and how many goats have you? No, I can't say how many I have because it's very bad luck. Is it? It is. Okay. Because you say, I could tell you now I have N amount of goats. Yes. And when I go home, they could be N minus one. Okay. So but you... at the moment, it's nearly N plus two. And oh, you can good. see we've beautiful lamb. Um, ah, lovely. Two little boys there born Monday morning. Ah, and yeah. Camille, do you milk the goats as well? I do. Yeah. I milk the goats and make a bit of cheese for family and friends and Didn't stuff like that. Didn't bring any with you, did you? No, not yet. But very soon I'll be sending it up to you. Mum and me is the only one milking at the moment. Oh, well, thanks for that, Sean. Yep. Lovely stuff. We're, we, 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 we put a lot of effort into you today. <laughs> yeah. And obviously the effort is only a one-way street at the moment because Sean doesn't care about us at all. Because he didn't bring any uh, lovely goat oh, cheese. Oh, yes, yes, Sean. No, 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 no. I have another present for you. That's OK. That's OK. <laughs> thanks for God, Sean. Sound, you, you, you brought us back. Go to I'm only joking, Sean. Only joking. Come here, are you excited about this makeover? I'm very much so, and I'm very just leaving it open to the gods now. You are a blank canvas. Blank canvas. You can canvas. do what you want. And do you know, it's a long time since we've had a man on this as well. I so was asked that, was that, am I the only man? But I, there must have been somebody. I think there might have been one or two others in the last 12 years. So I'm like John the Baptist. Like John the Baptist. We look forward to see what Sean the Baptist uh, will look <laughs> like at the end of the show. Oh, Sean, master. great to have you. Thanks, Tommy. Uh, Tommy Derbyshire. Oh, good. Tommy Derbyshire. Now, earlier on, we met a Kerry man, Sean O'Leary, and he is an art and horticulture teacher all the way from Port McGee in County Kerry. And recently, he lost his mojo, so he wanted it back. So Ali G was working on Sean's skin today. We had Stephen. We haven't seen Stephen for a while. He was trimming the beard, as you can see there. And Fiona kept the whole week looking for the perfect outfit for our Sean from Port McGee. Now, Sean came to us today after losing his mojo and his sense of style. He is a really artistic person, so we didn't want to lose that, but we did want to elevate his natural flair. So our mission was to help this fun-loving storyteller back to his full potential. So let's take a look at Sean earlier on when he came to us. Now he lives the outdoor life, so he probably let his hair go, his beard go, and he, he's not very good with his skin. And you know what? He wants to be real stylish too. So let us take a look at him now. The minute you walk, <laughs> the minute you walk. What do you think? Wow. Oh my God, I look 10 years younger. You look 10 years younger. You look amazing. Years younger. You know what, Sean? Seriously, you have such an artistic flair, as we said. But you know what? We all need a little bit of hulling back sometimes. Well, that's it. You know, And I think for, uh, if other people take an interest in you, you then... You do take more interest in yourself. It's like pushing a car when it needs to... You're so right. Now, first of all, let us talk about your hair. It is just fabulous, and your beard. Stephen Hennessy did the most I'm so most delighted job. he didn't just whack it off, as a lot of no. people would think. He really respected the beard and the look yeah. and just gave it that fantastic edge and shape, yeah. you know. Looks great. A sculptor. Now, your skin. I know, fantastic. You are sculpted well. in every way. Perfect. Ali Garvey, I yeah. just love it. She helped Beautiful. you Answer help to... yourself. And an angelic lovely. person as well. I know, she's yeah, a sweet angel. Lovely. Now, Fiona Hayes did the most amazing job. And, and I didn't know... Job. Yeah, because I didn't know... What you, well, I didn't know what you were going to pick because all these fabulous clothes are from best menswear. And Fiona really, really picked that perfect capsule wardrobe and saw your personality. Big time. And so just so lovely. Her. And it, it echoes everything within yeah, me as well, you know. She even got a new pair of shades. How cool is that? I should say, not shades, not glasses. Yeah. So, you know what? We know it's a special day because your birthday was yesterday. Mm -hmm. it, what age? Uh, 54. Well, what a great way to start the new year. Yes, big time. Here comes the <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Sean. Happy birthday to you. Grave Mark. Lord of us. All of our fads. Fair play, <laughs> Sean. You could, you could have turned him around and said you were 45. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? He can do that when he leaves here. You look but he looks 45. You That's do. It. You, look you, look you can have so much. pleasure to be with us today. Absolutely. It's, and it's been great to have a guy as well. Yeah, yeah perfect. So Sean, I'll hold on to this. Okay. Oh, that's right. I'll take it like this. Okay. walking forward like this. <laughs> we'll bring Listen, here, that, let's yours. bring out our glam squad. Of Love course, me. Fiona Hayes, our stylist today. And best, we have Stephen Hennessy hey. from Sophie Brown and Ali Garvey, who did the most amazing job. Well done, folks. Well done, well lads. You look done. amazing. Everyone's happy, Maura. Everyone's happy. We like happy. happy people on this show. We do. And I hope you guys are happy. We've had a great week, yeah. great guests. So thanks to all of you. We are back on Monday. James Patrice is here with all the ladies from yes. Dancing with the Stars, the first dance-off. Oh, my God. Have a great weekend. Ooh. See you then. See you soon. Bye.